What's up guys? Um, welcome back to the channel. If you haven't, please like, subscribe, ring that bell. Uh, so, I just finished installing the factory style brake controller. So my truck comes, or it came with the, uh, the trailer pro backup assist, whatever, whatever. So one big thing to look for, and we'll go look, is the fuse under your hood. Depending on what trim level truck you have, and I want to say it's fuse uh, block 24 is the space, but depending on what trim level you have, you may or may not have this fuse, which you're going to need it. And you may or may not even have the spot for it. So that 30 right there above my finger, next to the 10, the 20, the other 30, and that 40. So that 30 right there, in between the 50 and that 10, that is a fuse that you're going to need to even make this work. So that is for the circuit controlling the brake gain controller. Slide that back in. So, this video isn't showing how to install the, uh, the switch itself. There's plenty of videos out there. It's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, all you got to do is some, so I'll watch the video pulling this piece. You don't need to. So you pop this up. There's two 7 millimeter uh, screws here. Undo those. This whole fascia around your infotainment screen. This will pop out. And just pulling that out enough will give you the clearance you're going to need to pull this whole trim piece out. So you pull that piece out, depending if you're four-wheel drive or whatever. You have two connectors be, be, uh, behind these two. Disconnect those so you can pull the piece completely out. I had the little slot here, like a little coin slot cubby hole um, with a dummy switch on the back. So obviously pop that out, disconnect it, uh, and then that'll can only go in one way there's a little groove on the bottom slide that in plug it in of course and then reverse reinstall that stuff so when you get into force scan which this is where i kind of was having some issues so connect your vehicle um first i went to ipc model configuration play no oh, probably help if i i have power There we go. Uh, it'll be towards the bottom, under trailer. So there it is. This is a 2020. I haven't seen anybody post this yet. So on all you're gonna have to change is on this screen, trailer brake control module. Uh, it's already enabled, but you would click on that, go down to edit selected, if yours is going to be disabled. You click enable, click the check mark. You'll cycle the ignition. So that's it for that one. What I was having trouble with, so the other thing you do, go in IPC module configuration as built. Run it. And under, the only thing I had to change, under 72004-01, that third four, E441, the second four, the third number in the whole, you know, block, mine was a zero. So I changed it zero to a four and then you write it. That was it. So that was the, that's the two things you have to do. You don't have to do the 720701 uh, space because the options in Forescan's um, write up, none of those options are what to change matched up with what I pre-existing have in, in my block so I didn't change anything so all I did was 7200401 changed the 0 to a 4 in that first block and with the truck on I think I'm still connected to my little trailer to show you but I squeeze I squeeze a thing it pops up I can push plus and minus and change the gain see everything's working and I just went and uh, drove 
my little trailer around my property just to test it and everything worked great so i just squeeze this while i'm driving and only and engage the trailer brakes and then whenever i was driving and hit the brake pedal it also was hitting the brakes on the trailer so everything works so i'm super excited uh so yeah hopefully that helps somebody <laughs> i just posted all over the facebook pages uh, asking for help and nobody could nobody could help me um i'm guessing 2020 is the only year model where those are the two steps in four scan everything else I think there's three steps you have to change or three um, configurations you have to mess with but for the 2020 whatever reason it's just those two so um, yep hopefully that helps somebody out and uh, if you have any questions just comment on the video I'll do my best I can to help you guys out peace